Now in this week's show we're going to be fly fishing and elk hunting right outside of Chama, New Mexico. Now this is a pretty unique ranch. It's almost 6,000 acres and we're selling 40, 140 acre parcels off of this ranch. But the unique thing is, is that you still get to hunt, hike, and fish the entire 6,000 acres. Now we're going to start the show off going after an elk with Hoss Port. Guys, we just got to the ranch. We're out on our first meadow. And we got a bull bugling right up here above us. He doesn't sound like he's maybe 150 yards. He's already down below us. Across the mountain about 500 yards, Hall spots this young bull, but lets him go. What we've done is we went up high, heard them, and they're all heading down her side, paralleling them. And they're, they're staying in front of us. Here he spots another young bull up on the side of the mountain. And right before dark, this herd of cows comes out, but the bull stays in the trees. After the break, we finish up Hoss's elk hunt. Then we're going to do some fly fishing, and later I go after another bull. You know, last night when we got to the ranch, we heard a bunch of bulls bugling up high here and they were all coming down. We're pretty confident that they're coming back up now and they should be in these fields. Actually, can't quite see. Okay, right there I spot. There's a, there's a cow over there. Oh, there's a big six by six. Are you on him? Did he go down? Did he really? Oh, he's down. <laughs> I'll tell you what, we were walking out this logging road, but that's a nice bull. We're walking down this road here, and we come out in this field, and what was there, 40 elk? Well, man, we got a nice bull down. This happened real quick this morning. We were coming on a, walking out a logging road, and uh, right at first light, we could hear the animals bugling. Snuck right out, everything worked perfect. About 40 animals in the herd. This was the biggest bull, and down he is. For more information on one of these great ranches for sale, give us a call. Well, we're just catching a bunch of fish down here on this little pond here. We got the river right behind us, and I think we're gonna try to hit it here in a little bit. I mean, as soon as you put this fly in there. Oh, did you see that? Oh, got enough. Yep, got one. I mean, and they are all full of trout. It's a little better one. <laughs> oh, there he is right there. No. That's the biggest one of the day right there. That's a good fish. Dude, that's a big fish. Look at that guy right there. That's a big trout. Nice rainbow. We just came out in this field. There was a nice bull in here, but he spotted us and he took off about 400 yards right up into the bushes. I couldn't get on him, so we're gonna sneak up here, see if we can see him. Before dark, we spot these cows, but no more bulls. Well, we 
see a couple of cows over here. <coughs> we don't see any bulls though. We don't hear anything this morning. But this is where they've been at, so there's gotta be there's gotta be some bulls in here. Especially if we got those cows over there. So we'll hang out here for a little while, see what happens. spotted the bull yet. We uh we just heard an elk bugle. He's on the other side of this knob where this cow is right there. So we're gonna let that cow walk off, then we're gonna go try to take a look at this bull. Are you on it? <sighs> nice bull. Well, we're here again at another great property for sale. And this time we're in Chama, New Mexico. And as you can see, elk everywhere. We had another great hunt. This morning we came in here, we saw some cows back up here, but there was no bull. So we just kind of hung out a little bit, had some turkeys come right in. Then we heard this bull bugle a couple of times. We set up, man, he came right out on us. Earlier you saw Hoss take a nice six by six bull. This property's got some excellent fly fishing for trout. Has a little bit of everything right here outside of Chama, New Mexico.